everyone! Welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to make leaf coasters. This is a free crochet pattern found on Interest by Catherine Light. Uh, this has six rounds, so it will be easy to make. But I modified it a little bit, so let's start. We will need two colors a dark one and light one so this is six ply cotton yarn then we have a pair of scissors we have a stitch marker we have darning needle and crochet hook size 3.25 millimeters and tape measure I will start with a darker colored yarn. If you like, you can start with a lighter one. First, we'll make a magic ring. And then, chain 3. This chain 3 will count as our first double crochet. And then, double crochet more 15 times. So, we will have at the end, 16 double crochets. I'm on my last double crochet. After the 15th double crochet, we have to pull the tail so that we will close the ring. And then slip stitch on the third chain. Round one is finished. Round two, chain two, and then double crochet onto the next stitch. This is a double crochet two together and then chain one into the same stitch make a double crochet but do not finish it and then make another double crochet into the next stitch but do not finish it and then Finish the double crochet two together and then chain one. So we will do this all around double crochet into the same stitch but do not finish and then double crochet into the next stitch, do not finish and then finish both double crochet and then chain one. Repeat this all around and I will see you at the end. I am at the last two double crochet together. Chain one and then double crochet into the same space. And then to the finish, double crochet into the slip stitch of the previous round. double crochet and chain one and slip stitch onto the top of the first double crochet two together and round two is finished round three single crochet directly into the chain one space three times one Single crochet two times into the next chain space. One, two, and then half 
double crochet into the same chain space. We can use our stitch marker and place it on the first single crochet that we did here. But stitch markers are optional so either you can use it or not. It's okay. Then next into the single chain here make a two half double crochet. the same space make one double crochet and then on the next chain space make three double crochets Three chain space, one, two, three, make three double crochets on each space. One, two, three, chain space, make two double crochet, one, two, and then on the same space, make one treble crochet. From this first space, chain space, we will go backwards and the same pattern as this one. Okay, and one treble crochet, two double crochet in the same space, and then on the next four chain space. One, two, three, four. We will make three double crochets. After finishing the four sets of three double crochet, one, two, three, four, into the next chain space, make one double crochet and two half double crochet. the next chain space make one half double crochet and two single crochet one, two. into the last chain space make three double single crochets Chain one, and then into the same stitch, make a single crochet, then chain two, skip the next stitch and make a single crochet into the next stitch, chain two, and then skip the next stitch, single crochet to the next. So repeat this pattern all around. Single crochet, chain 2, single crochet, chain 2, skipping one stitch in between the single crochets. I'm not 
my last single crochet skip one and single crochet and chain two space one two and then slip stitch directly into the single crochet that we first round four is finished you will have 24 single stitches and 24 chain 2 spaces round 5 directly go to the chain 2 space and make 3 single crochet Make another 3 single crochets into the chain 2 space. 1, 2, and 3. Into the next chain 2 space, make 2 single crochets. the next chain to space make two half double crochet one two and then make one double crochet one and two into the next six chain two spaces make three double crochet three double crochet into the next and then we will come back after we finish all the six sets I'm at the six sets of three double crochet into the next chain to space make two double crochet and make one treble crochet Into the next chain to space, make two treble crochet. Three and make double treble crochet. One, two, three, and four. And then chain two. We finish the half of the leaf. So Starting from this chain 2, we will do the same pattern but going backwards. Into the next chain 2 space, make 1 double treble crochet, make 2 treble crochet, into the next chain 2 space, make 1 treble crochet, and make two double crochet. And then into the next six chain to space, make the sets of three double crochet. Instead, 
get the lighter colored yarn because you will change color so From your last round and then slip stitch into the first single crochet of the previous round and then pull the loop and you will start round six okay chain one and single crochet into the next stitch single crochet in again to the next stitch and then we will make a pico chain three one two three and slip stitch into the single crochet there's your pico next skip the next stitch and single crochet into the next and then single crochet again to the next and then make your pico stitch to the single crochet here's another pico so we will repeat the pattern starting from here going to the tip of the leaf and then I will come back here skip the next stitch single crochet to the next make another single crochet and then another pico Travel crochet, make another single crochet, and make a pico. One, two, three. Slip stitch, skip one stitch, single crochet into the next stitch. One, and single crochet into the next, and make another pico. One, two, three. into the next stitch here the loop of the previous round and then chain seven one two three four five six seven uh, counter picos we should have a total of 25 picos all around and then um, at the third chain 
going backwards, one, two, three, make a single crochet. One, and then single crochet until here. Also. What do you think? Which is better? The plain one or the one with the two colored? Isn't the pattern so easy? If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and please share. Thank you for watching.